What is going on? Big Daddy Chino here, bringing you another kill confirm uh, gameplay on the Met Village. Uh, yeah, this is Modern Warfare 3. I am using the M4 with Blind Eye, uh, Hardline, and Marksman. Uh, my kill streaks are Permiso, Raper, and Pavlo. So yeah, uh, as you can see, this is my third commentary already getting getting used to doing some commentaries uh, and I kinda like it so yeah please let me let me get some feedback on the comments you drop a like comment at the favorites if you want to I'm not forcing you but it, it helps me out tremendously like um, white boy says uh, the more likes I, I guess it, it enables my video to get like a little bit more views and that means new subscribers will probably like my content so yeah keep those likes coming up and um yeah I will be very appreciated so let's start talking about uh my uh Modern Warfare 3 well Modern Warfare 3 uh it's a good game I won't lie it, it at least it has like some dedicated time although I, I feel like Infinity War is like adding new prestiges like oh here here let me let's throw in five new prestiges for Modern Warfare 3 but like some of the stuff like the patching for like some of the FMGs, like FMGs akimbos, like are still overpowered. Although they they they, they patched them a couple of times, some of the the glitches on the infected, they actually haven't been patched, and stuff like that. You know, like sometimes the host migration and it kicks you out back to the lobby. L little stuff like that is what makes people piss off and like Infinity War just trying to cover it all up with like adding new procedures and new content every month and stuff like that you know just to cover of what they're doing but although uh, I don't really care much but uh, to me I feel like it's a it's a really good game at least at least they, they are dedicated to to add new content and probably fix in the future but you know, since Call of Duty is a franchise, they're like, oh, they'll make this, and if something fails, they'll try to improve it in the next game. You know, that's how they keep their consumers, and that's how people end up buying their games. So, uh, I'm not really that excited for Black Ops 2. As, um, well, Black Ops 1, uh, the regular Black Ops, I didn't quite like it as much. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't know, maybe, for me, it was some type of bullshitty. Uh, as killing a, a person with a whole entire clip to me was like some type of ridiculous but some people think it's a really good game but I don't blame them you know everybody has their own opinion but to me I, I didn't quite like it so I'm not quite excited for Black Ops 2 but I mostly been an Infinity War uh, guy since Call of Duty 4 Call of Duty 4 was my first Call of Duty ever and I I, I still think to me it was the best probably because I played it first but since I got used to it so much, I know every map by heart. Uh, I know where to go, search, any game mode. I, I I do really good on that game. So I I always think the Call of Duty 4 was the best. Second um second on game from Infinity War that I played with Modern for two. I thought it was really good until the hackers and Woman Army and Nuke Two and never got patched. And then boosters for tactical nuke and stuff like that. It, it really got messed up. So Infinity War didn't take care of it. So hopefully they take care of it this Modern Warfare 3. Because uh, I haven't seen no hackers yet. Yet I haven't seen no hackers. But I think still is a pretty good game. Like I said, Kill, Kill Confirmed is like one of my favorite game modes that I usually post gameplay. Uh, usually because I know the spawn points and I don't know. I feel like it's less campy because uh, people have to get those golden tags in order if you win. If you're gonna camp, you're never gonna get the tags, you know, and you're always gonna end up losing. Doesn't matter how how much uh, positive you're going, you're still getting a loss, so it doesn't still count as uh, going positive, you know. So yeah, that's what I usually play. But let me know in the comments if you want to know uh, if you want me to post another game mode maybe some free for all team deathmatch I don't know ground war anything I I'll try my best to to get a uh, gameplay going and do some commentary in it and let me get some questions and let me sh um, let me get some feedback of what you think how I'm doing uh, is my new mic 
the quality sound better does it still have that buzzy noise or you know just let me know it's little stuff like that one guy sent me a, a private message saying what was my clan as you can see uh every time i kill someone you know my little clan pops up that is different from everybody else's is like yellow and in order to have that clan tag you must be like uh call of duty elite member i don't i don't think you have to be a premium I, oh look at that quad yeah like i was saying you don't need to be like a premium member i, I guess just by joining the site and um if someone is a premium member and they they have a clan they could just send you an invite and and you gotta level up your clan i believe it's like level 10 or something you unlocked it or i, I don't i don't really know since i'm not the clan leader but uh, my clan is like level 21 so we we unlocked a lot of stuff we unlocked uh the golden ta clan tag um like three titles already i don't i don't i'm not sure if you can unlock emblems you can customize your your title i know for sure because uh uh the, the, the clan leader customized it and put it um in a, a month before she put something else and then this month she put something else so yeah what my clan tag stands for is uh girl gone gamer that's what you can see is ggg and girl gone gamer is a is also another youtube commentator on youtube she's a girl and she's a machinima director so yeah she has like around almost 20,000 subscribers so she's pretty famous on youtube and she's a really nice player i played with her like a couple of times maybe like around five or six and she's really good i i, I can even say she's better than me so yeah she'd be going like really positive last time i was playing with her she told me she was going to do a overwatch gameplay and she took out her mic and you know she started playing she has some astros a40s i i, I think she that's what she said last on um, her last video so yeah you should go check her out she's really good uh, uh i was really fortunate that i as soon as i saw her video saying that she needed people to recruit for her clan tag the requirements were not much so if you have these requirements you, you need to you need to have like a mic uh your your kd ratio has to be above one so it's not that hard my my kd is like around one 150 around there 1.50 1. so i i kind of got in really fast and i was like a 10 prestige when i applied so she sent me a, a like a clan invite through call of duty elite and i just accepted it so that's how i'm in her clan so um, hope one day I, I could finally meet her in person but i don't know that's until the future so I'm not really a magician or psychic to to know when is that gonna happen, but I'm really looking forward to. So, yeah. Another another thing I wanted to talk about was uh, one of my friends, Skimmer Tiger Town Launch Sixty Six, is gonna open up a, a channel soon, and he's gonna have like new content of every game uh, that's gonna come out, like the newest games such as uh, Resident Evil Six, Raccoon City. He, he's gonna have an unboxing and he's gonna have a a walkthrough from the starting of the game all the way to the end so for you people that it's your first time playing Resident Evil or if you get stuck in a part he's gonna help you manage to go through also he's gonna buy like new different games like Street Fighter vs Tekken which is gonna come out I believe in this week he's gonna have that as well he's gonna start doing his own commentaries and sometimes I might even have him as a guest um, Cause he, he lives close by so he might he might come to my house and do a duo commentary so let me know in the comments and i'll leave a link on the description you can also like me on facebook on twitter there i'll post like my latest updates like when i put a new video up or or i don't know like special content or a free website where you can go a, a random funny video uh, also I will leave uh, on the video description this funny video that my friend recorded on the Fort Train on your and it's really funny you will laugh your ass off so yeah please drop a like uh, comment favorite if you want to you know like I'm saying I am my final score I believe was 48 uh, 48 and 9 there you go so thank you big daddy out and yeah goodbye